this is Sheena and I am back with a very overdue video. This video is basically me giving out some recommendation on books that I, I would love for you guys to read, especially if you're in the process of transforming your life like I am. So I'm just going to give off a list of books, all of the books. Um, however, these are just a few of some good books that I would uh, recommend that you guys read. Um, the first book on the list is called Let Go and Live Your Dreams. This is Life Shift by Alita St. James. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of her, but she is the lady that actually had twins in her 60s. Uh, yes, she was able to uh, give birth to twins, not uh, with the help of any doctor. She actually, um, she was artificial inseminated uh, with with you know someone else's sperm but she other than that she didn't take any uh, fertility drugs she actually manifests these babies on her own so she's just she's a life coach and she's also a healer and this is an excellent book because she actually teaches you how to use your feminine energy um, of manifestation to create the life that you want or the life of your dream so I believe uh, this is an excellent book and you can find any book really on amazon.com so I'll put the link below to Amazon um, where you can find any of the books that that I'm saying here today that I'm listening today the next book is called the Hidden Power. This is by my teacher Nazir Ra. Um, this is he's an awesome guy. I actually had a chance to actually sit in his universities. Um, well, not in his class. He calls them the uh, the Hidden Power University. But uh, he's an awesome teacher. And uh, sorry, this is my son Jaden. If you can see him in the camera, he's trying to get in the video. Uh, but this is a success book. It's not like the all the rest of the success books that you may have read before. He, instead of, you know, you know how some success books tell you how to uh, write down a goal and then check off the goal once you complete the goal? Well, he actually says that that's a waste of time. Instead of writing down all of your goals, he wants you to actually just write down the life that you want to live and just start living it. So this is a good book. And if you, he has a YouTube channel. So if you um, would like, I can just go ahead and put the link down below for his YouTube channel so that you can check out a lot of, um, you know, his teachings. Um, let's see. The next book, and this is Jaden. Jaden with um, Jaden, aka Batman. Jaden, do you want to say hello? Hello. In my school is named Kindergarten. Pravo Kindergarten. Yeah, Bradfield Kindergarten. Yes, and we have to get to bed because you have to go there in the morning. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and get through these books. Okay, so the next book is called Hidden Power, How to Unleash the Unleash the Power of Your Subconscious Mind. This is by James K. Van Fleet. Uh, this is a very good book because it shows you how to reprogram your mind. Um, a lot of times... Some of our uh, our beliefs that we have about ourselves, you know, um, the reason why we're not manifesting the life of our dreams is because deep down in our subconscious mind, we um, have programmed ourselves to uh, think that we are less than. So this just shows us how to um, reprogram our mind so that we can start manifesting those things in our life. And it starts in the mind. Everything starts in the mind. Um, the next book is You Can Heal You Can Heal Your Life. Uh, this is a very good book because a lot of times, now this book um, is by Louise Hay. Uh, she's wrote several other books as well. Um, her main focus is on really on health. And she talks a lot about like a lot of diseases that people come down with are not just because of the disease itself. There's a hidden um something deep there's other causes to the diseases and a lot of times it's linked to um, something emotional so she these this book is just a book of different exercises that you can do with by yourself or with a friend um, and it, it just helps you on healing your life um, she also has an index in the back where she lists different diseases 
and different illnesses because she says that you know our thought patterns um, we create our life through our, our thought patterns and even when we become ill and become sick a lot of time that is linked through um, you know a thought pattern that we have about ourselves or something that we don't want to let go um, and so she has an index of, of pretty much mostly you know uh, very common diseases or, or health issues and she gives the problem she gives the problem cause and then she gives a new thought pattern uh, that can actually help cure that disease or, or problem so it's a it's a very good book and it goes in alphabetical order like she even has on here blackheads okay and she says blackheads come from small outbursts of anger that could be the cause of of your blackheads and she says the new thought pattern to have is I calm my thoughts and I am serene so it's a good book I like it um also there is chanel cooper sykes her book stilettos in the kitchen which is a awesome book it teaches you how to become a phenomenal woman um there's also a book that i love it, here it's called short meditations um, meditation is just a way to calm your mind i think everybody should meditate no no matter what your religious beliefs are what you believe i think everybody should take that time to meditate and, and clear your thoughts um meditation people who meditate is actually uh proven uh that they actually live longer lives uh that they're happy and they're more stressed and they're stress-free so, um, short meditation is called, it's a complete idiot's guide to short meditation and just gives different short meditations that you can start off with, um, that, to guide you through the meditation process. So, um, that's my book list. I hope that this helps. If it didn't, um, I'm sorry, I just hope that it helps someone. These books have helped me. And like I said, these are just, these are not all the books that I read. And I'll be sure to share more uh, books with you. So there will definitely be a part two to the video. So uh, Mr. Jaden, he did not, he has, he's having trouble going to sleep. So that's where we're going to go. Um, we're going to go uh, hit the bed. And I will hope to get to another video out to you uh, very soon. Okay. Good night, you guys. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Love you.